Die sieben internationalen Nachwuchstalente haben keine Zeit für Jetlag. Sie starten mit der ersten Phase im NFL International Pathway Programm. Die nächsten drei Monate liegt der Fokus auf Football. Zwölf Stunden am Tag, sechs Tage die Woche für eine Chance in der NFL. Ein Traum, der nur für vier von ihnen in Erfüllung gehen wird. This is your first day of being an NFL pro. Your body is a commodity and it's all about the details. It's all about the process. It's putting it all together and training you so you know how to really be a pro. C'est un jury. Você brincou com minha sensibilidade. This is my brother, Eugenio Jr. He is my best friend and he was playing with me my whole life. He was the line right behind, beside me. Who's bigger? I'm bigger. I'm bigger. I'm bigger, faster and stronger. Bigger and I'm stronger. I thank God every day for my family. We cry together, we laugh together. I want to be able one day to say, hey dad, you don't need to work anymore. I will take care of you like you did for me and my brothers. I always was a big guy. What I love is judo. Du começou a lutar judô muito cedo, muito novo. Que o judô é um, é um esporte, como todo esporte, que, que traz disciplina, né? Dudu sempre foi muito hiperativo. Ele sempre foi muito ativo, Brin corria muito, brincava o dia todo. Judo helped me a lot what I am now, like my base, my stretch, my balance. But like after I discovered football, I fell in love for the sport and here I am. É um, é a gente, eu falo assim que nós pais, eu como mãe, a gente se realiza através dos filhos. Eu espero que através dessa, dessa carreira dele, muitos jovens né, se inspirem nele. Quando o Dudu deu a, a notícia que o sonho dele era ir para os Estados Unidos, né, e falei, meu filho, vai, né, Deus vai abrir a porta para vocês. We went to Brazil to watch him play and we met his parents. You can see the same uh, drive and passion that they have for him and the passion that he has for his country and the passion to make a difference and to make opportunities easier for the next person that comes behind him. E tá um degrau de cada vez é porque algo bom vai acontecer. Então, acredita que vai dar certo. Né? Demos total apoio. I studied my whole life since I was 14 years old for being a great farmer. And I always try to be ready for helping my father in the farm. And then in 2017, when I finished my college, I said, Dad, I will try like go to the US and try to be a professional football player. And I was waiting for him to say, son, I need you. I'm old, I need your help. I need your help, but He didn't. He said, he said to me, Duzão, can you, can you imagine how this can, can change the life of the poor kids in Brazil? You, you will be, be a mirror for everybody. This year, the seven players come from a multitude of backgrounds, professional rugby union, professional rugby league, amateur and semi-pro American football. No matter where you come from, you haven't had access to the facilities that they have access to here. Maximo, stay still, please. <laughs> Next test is going to look at your muscle mass and body fat percentage. This is Patricia. Uh, she's going to do your This is amazing, man. In Brazil, we don't have enough compare like this. I think in most of the counts, they don't have nothing like this. Every practice, players are going to be wearing a GPS and accelerometer unit, just making sure that they're doing enough work to, uh, to get bigger, faster, stronger. Ready, go. Oh, these amazing displays. For me, it's like a paradise. It's like sport heaven. 
you've got world-class trainers, you've got world-class coaches, you've got somewhere you can go and fully immerse yourself in your training program. We have all we need. Right now it's like we got to prove like we really want to go to the league. We've seen guys before us that came through this program and how successful they are. So all we have to do is make sure every day we come and we bring the energy and we put in the work that is required, you know. Obviously we're all here for, for one purpose, to try to get a, a spot on the team and um, yeah, we're all going to train hard, work our backside off to, to do that and we want to try to be the best athlete you can to give yourself the best shot. Thank you. You're welcome. Next up. I was born and raised in Townsville, uh, Australia. My biggest challenge, you know, obviously making this transition, I would just be um, probably just training my hardest. You know, I've got a lot catching up to do, and um, you know, I've got to obviously learn the playbook a lot, and you know, ten times harder than than most of these other guys because I didn't play college ball, I didn't, you know, play high school. He's achieved everything at a very young age, and again, similar to Christian, he he wants to challenge himself. Um, against the best athletes in the world. It's cream dry. <laughs> Go on. Yeah. You don't need oil on them. The best way I'd explain Val is, is quite a perfectionist. So in everything he does, he's a celebrity here. We can't go anywhere without you know, people watching. I spot it from a mile away. He doesn't notice, but yeah, the, he's a little local celebrity. <laughs> Two eyes and a smiley face. <laughs> his dad no, that's mine. is his biggest fan, and um, his sister is also a big fan. They all wear his football gear, and um, he's got a very supportive family. It'll be fun. Be a bit hard, but looking forward to it. Mm -hmm. Be a good challenge. I want to be a professional football player because you know, I just wanted to prove to people in Sydney that, that you know, we can do it as well from a, from a country town and you know, I thought no better way to try and push myself to, to bigger heights and, and um, you know, challenge myself even more and then come over here with the best. Today, we, we're going to work some drills. We're going to, try, we're going to find out you know, about you athletically, how you move, okay? try, to, try to assist in the process of building a foundation to help you move efficiently and powerfully. Now, some people don't believe in, in trying to be perfect. I do. I believe that you try to do whatever your assignment is perfectly. If you show the development that we're looking for, what we'll be looking for, you will be with the team. Y'all know a couple of guys that made it to some teams last year, and they stayed with the team the whole year. They made it. They went through the process. And that's why you want to try to be perfect. That makes sense? Sir. We good? I think the biggest challenge for me is definitely going to be the mental side, things from the playbook, learning a whole new game, and only having pretty much three months or so to kind of get it nailed down and have a, a good solid base. You know, it's such a, not only a, a total different ball game, but it's a, a big move. You know, it was a, a massive flight to come over here and, and to try and pursue something that I've never really played before, I've only watched. The thing that I want to kind of prove to myself in the next six months is that I could learn and apply myself and do something new that has never been done before. Focus. Focus. Train your mind. Train your eyes. If you train your eyes and you train your mind, you can catch the rock. So, so what this drill right here is what, what I call it eyes to hands. Drive out. Drive out. Who are you looking at? I'm the running back. I have the ball in my hand. You gotta see me, I got the ball. There are core elements that they have to learn in order to be successful. Okay, again, step. If you oh, develop oh. a fundamental base, then you always have something to go back to, and that's no different from anybody that really plays football. Club it, swipe it. We got a couple of guys that are a little bit more raw than others, so we're gonna have to maybe do some extra tutoring or some extra time to, to help persuade them along. There's a lot of talent out there. It just needs to be coached and pointed in the right direction. Yeah. Set. Hut. It's really an individual journey. Every challenge is different to each player. That's it. The physical side of things, I believe I've got 
stuff to offer and great attributes, but I definitely need to take those up. Where you going? Before I didn't go to try and compete with the best players in the world who have been doing it since they were yay high. This next three months, you know, I just want to push myself and, and see by the end of the three months whether I'm worthy enough to, you know, to be able to play straight away in the NFL. Got to, definitely got a lot of work to do and train hard and work hard and try and give everything I can in, in each game. Obviously, I, I've, I've had experience playing here in America, but even for American guys that played college football, the transition into the pros is, is a huge step. Where Jakob is, there's the sunshine. Everybody loves him. First he played soccer and swimming, ice hockey, basketball. But after a while, it was like boring for him. In the end, I had this idea that he could play football like his father was playing football. He said, Mama, that's it. I will play football. Once I started playing it, I just knew that it was the right sport for me. I just think that that's what I'm here to do. I wasn't okay with how my college career ended and how, how all that stuff played out. I always told him to have a plan B. If plan A doesn't um, go well, you need a plan B. I'd already had training to become an EMT lined up and kind of was getting ready to, to transition out of football. And then getting the, the call from, from Will lit up a spark in me because I was like, okay, I'm going to get another chance. Um, I gotta take full advantage of it. It's nothing about money or being a professional. He's making this dream come true. I'm very happy for him. When I started playing football, I thought that the NFL is just something that, that was like far away in the distance that I'd probably never even get close to. You know, you only get one life, you know? You only get one life, you gotta, gotta decide what you do with it. But now, you know, there's, there's this pathway, and uh, I, I wanna show kids that you, if you put in the work and you persevere, you can, you can really make it happen. Auch wenn jeder Spieler für sich kämpft, ist der Zusammenhalt noch wichtiger. Als künftige Botschafter des Sports müssen die Talente auch die Verantwortung tragen, Football in ihren Heimatländern zu repräsentieren. Und damit der Sport noch weiter wachsen kann, müssen sie ein Team werden. We have two houses, uh, one for the offense, one for the defense. Of course, you, you got Val, uh, he's, the, he's the Australian guy. Like he's, he, he just uses Australian slang words. Like for example, he told me the other day that uh, a good looking girl in Australian is a good sort. And I was like, what? <laughs> and then you got Christian on, on the other hand. You know, he's he's the big joker. He's a character. He's you know, he's very funny. He's he's not not the quiet one. Now, oi, he don't like it. That's why he try and give everyone. <laughs> My homemade is Maximus. He he's the best guy. <laughs> I, I love those guys. Uh, they are so funny. Always make uh, a pranks. <laughs> We all came in like, you know, we all know this is a competition. And to hear the story, where they're from, and how they're chasing the dream, it feel like we all have something to hold us together that now I know why he, he's here, you know. We're a very tight-knit group already. And um, I think in order for us to be successful, we all need to work together anyhow. Some of us are at different levels in terms of football knowledge and uh, physical attributes and stuff, so it's going to be a, almost like a team effort. The typical week, it will be a six-day week, and every day has a different focus. Today, Monday, is all about get-off. You know, we understand fully that what we're asking them to do is extremely hard, and if we were to start off at too high a pace, then their bodies could fail early and we could have injuries. And we make sure that we give them some downtime. They need to relax. These guys, they, my, my homemates, the international players, they are crazy. Bro. So what about that flip though, bro? You want to make you do in the pool? Yeah, yeah, of course. Let's go. The Germans guy, they are really crazy. <laughs> we be having fun. Oh my God. We know each other like for three, three days, something like that. Yeah, I love it. It's, 
it's, it's really nice. Yesterday was the first time like in a while we, we go out to having fun and like talk and relax a little bit. <laughs> And we decided to go across the road where there's some, like, a live band playing. The boys are like, go up and play. They, sure enough, they called me up. All right, we're going to yeah. Christian, wake yeah. on up. Christian, yeah. wake yeah. on up. How you doing, bro? You all right? Let's In the last two, three days, we are trying to like, make us a great family. I'm not competing against them. I'm competing against myself. I want any of them to make it, you know? Each one of us has a, has a great story. Each one of us has a family that they want to make proud. So, you know, I wish we could, we could all go. Good, good, that's excellent. If I make it to the league, it's going to impact us all massively. Like, NFL is on a, on a global scale. Really, nothing is impossible. Like, if they put in the work, working hard, chasing the dream. Time to get better, bro. They're all supporting me. I've got a, a pretty big fan base back home. If I made it, I think I'd be over the moon. I will go to the NFL this year. I can open the door for the next Mexican players. One thing everybody has to remember that's involved in football is you need football more than football needs you. It doesn't matter the background. As a professional athlete, you're paid to win. I never work hard so hard for my life for one thing. It's about perseverance, you know. You have to know who you are, and you've got to be able to, to persevere to reach the goals that you want to reach. Just relax. Take a deep breath. My greatest strength is my, my mindset. Are you ready? Ah, here we go. My true competence is with, with myself. Hit, move those feet. Come on, feet to the ground. I'm ready to do everything. OK, let's go. Like, I'm ready. Yes, sir. I was born in Brazil, but I know I can, I can be one of the best here. Ready? One, two, three. Defense! Defense!